What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Clarence Robinson, aka the Flavor King. A little bit about myself. I'm an Asheville native. I was a military brat in my life. I got a chance to travel and stay in Hawaii, California, Washington State, and come back to my city. Um, of course, I made a couple of uh, wrong decisions in my life upon being a youth and, and, and wanting to follow the crowd, not realizing that I was a leader instead of a follower. But once I found my path, um, I created what I call um, something that would help my community after getting the opportunity to work at Grove Park Inn right around 2007. I was working on my GED. I decided to get my culinary right then and there. So right around 2009, I got my culinary at AB Tech in which I moved into cooking at um, Grove Park Inn. So there I worked for a couple of different chefs and guys that I felt like didn't have respect for the food. You know, they didn't have respect for their employees most of all. And, um, I've seen a lot of different little things working for them. So I created Cooking with Comedy Catering. Um, let me see if I can get this flip right. Ooh, so I'm saying. So I created Cooking with Comedy Catering to do two things that was good for the human body and to also uh, bring laughter with food. You know, two things for the human body that's good for the human body. So I created Cooking with Comedy Catering and I wanted to basically um, show kids that was coming up in my, my community and in the local surrounding areas a different outlook on black men. Instead of wanting to be a drug dealer or wanting to be a basketball player or a rapper and all that, I was like, man, you could be a chef too. You know, I just want to throw something else in there so they can um, open up their vision more. So I tackled it. I was just doing cooking classes and stuff. I partnered up with Go Green Opportunities and I was doing cooking classes with them. And then people was raving about my food in the city. They was like, hey, listen, man, you need to um, you need to go ahead and basically start selling your food, you know, because I wasn't trying to make no money. I wasn't, I wasn't doing it for that. I was doing it to basically make a statement and a stand in my community. So the city started hitting me up. I started doing stuff with the city, and I just I took off from there. Like, I worked at all the main restaurants you could probably think of in Asheville. Like, Biscuit Head, Sunny Point, Another Broken Egg, uh, Chestnut, Mayfields, The Grand Bohemian, um, The Veranda out in Black Mountain. I ran the Asheville Event Center for two years, executive chef there. So it was like I was all over the place, um, all over the place with my cooking and stuff. And then I was like, I started writing down my vision and my dreams of what I wanted to do. I was like, man, I want to go national. I want to be on TV. I want to do this. So I ended up doing stuff for Ingles Table with Ingles. And then I ended up um, having the opportunity to travel and do stuff with Food Network. I competed in Cutthroat Kitchen, season 17, uh, episode four. Uh, it's called I'm Kind of a Big Deal. So if you want to find me there nationally, you can find me there. I'm also, I also made it to America's Funniest Home Videos as well. But I'm gonna keep it short because I'm in the middle of work. So you can also reach me at Cooking With Comedy Catering on Facebook, also Cooking With Comedy uh, Gmail at gmail.com. And then you can also hit me up at 828-280-7957. Don't forget to Google Clarence Robinson, AKA The Flavor King. Holla at your boy, Miles.